shotgun snap. Oh, he's open. There he is. Pass one across the middle. Yep. Pass is caught. And there's a big swing by Huey. Blaine, stop that ball from coming over I here. I didn't what, see it coming back fine. Brookshire says, but Bernie with the rebound. A steal. And a steal. And a steal. And He's running the last lay, uh, leg. That could be gold. And a gold. And a gold. Yeah, it's over. <laughs> In the third. Brings another one. There's another ground ball to shortstop, fielded by Herber, who fires it over to first base for out number three. Oh, she got a hold of that one. Naming on by. Is gone. There you go. Wow. What a hit. I didn't take her long. No. Juan Galarza. Welcome to another Billy's Live production. Find us on your favorite social sites and apps. Like, subscribe, and get notified when we go live. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Brad Holland here with Kyle Tribe bringing you the final home regular season game for Lady Billy's softball. And uh, they're so excited. They started 15 minutes early. <laughs> We're still getting prep and ready to go, and they're like, all right, here we go. It's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ball's in. We're like, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> so catch up real quick. We got a two-ball, two-count strike on the lead-off batter, him is Riley Smith for Bandera. We'll try to get caught up as we go. A little outside. going to be ball three to bring the count full. But thanks for joining us. Nice evening this evening. Hey, the sun is kind of tucked down back behind the clouds. We don't have to stare at that. We don't have to look at that. No. little breeze. Not too, Nothing too terribly windy. Yep. So JV win? Yes. JV win their game. Mm -hmm. Five to nothing. Fouls that one into the dugout. Finished up there. And uh, yeah, they had a great game. Yeah. A great game. Heck yeah. Good game. Speaking of great games, Lady Billies are sitting in at 28-5 and five in on the season and uh, looked at the rankings this morning. They're currently ranked ninth in the state in Class 4A. So they've played a couple yeah. of good games. That is great. Oh, hard hit off of Brendel's thigh. Took a mean hop. All right, we're going to be back in just a minute after pay a few ads. Fredericksburg has put its confidence in Security State Bank and Trust for over 80 years. And now that same honesty and integrity is available for wealth management. We're not so much about timing the market, but time in the market. Not chasing returns, but capturing them. And not just for the affluent either. We're here to help anyone with their financial goals. A custom portfolio product based on your plan, your goals, your purpose. Give us a call today, 990-7750. All right, thanks for joining us back. We got 0 1 count here. We got a runner at first, top of the first inning. And Stewie throws that one past her for strike two. Uh, Miss Riley Smith over there at first base. Uh, hard hit ball to uh, Brenda Wolf at third. Uh, took a mean little hop. She played it off the glove and uh, wasn't able to get her out at first. So we got a runner on with nobody out. But uh, 0 2 count on Genesee Wheeler. And oh, yeah. she goes oh, on that one. That oh, was yeah, strike he three. <laughs> He's like, oh, yeah, girl, you, yeah. you, you swung. Yeah. Hands never broke, but uh, it passed the plane of the front of the plate. Yes, <laughs> yes, definitely broke. She that. held it tight. She did a good job. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So one away. Like I said, we're starting about 15 minutes early here, so we're still trying to get caught up on all the programming and processing and getting everything running. Swing and a miss there. That is uh, Presley Greenley at the plate for the Lady Bulldogs. Swing and a miss. First pitch there. Yeah, we want to say a big shout out to our title sponsor, Warner Electric. Really appreciate Dwight and Carmen uh, helping us out. I believe they uh, sponsored us all year. Um, yes, sir. And that's that's really cool. It's really nice and make 
makes our job a lot easier. We can actually concentrate. <laughs> you know, oh, heck once yeah. we get that kind of commitment, it's really appreciated. And uh, thank you so much. Call him for all your electrical needs. Thirty years of experience and uh, dependable and everything. Eight three zero four five six five five one nine. Call Dwight Lunder. Strikeout number two for Miss Stewie. That's going to bring number four, Kaylin Ortiz, to the plate for the Lady Bulldogs with two away, runner at first. Stewie gets her pitch call and steps in. Wing and a miss for strike one. Oh, one the count here. Stu Wright, too. Let's try to uh, shout out, as always, to Miss Christy Wright. Running the scoreboard up there for us, right there next to our title sponsor, Winter Electric. She's uh, responsible for keeping all those dots and numbers in the right place in the right order. So we definitely appreciate yeah, Miss Christy. Oh, that flare is just foul on the right field. The count's going to remain 0 2. Yeah, no, a huge, uh, huge victory right here for the golf team. Oh, uh, guys or girls? Guys or girls, let's make sure we quit. Oh, yeah, okay, who are we going to go with? Okay, well, the guys, the guys. they won. So, the guys yeah. won regionals, yeah. true. Yes, they didn't just win regionals. <laughs> they killed it. I yeah, heard they up by 30 strokes. Yes, Is that what 30 I 30-stroke lead a win over the second-place second team place at regionals. <laughs> at regionals. At regionals. No, you know, appreciate uh, A.D. Wendy drove all the way down to Victoria. She left at 4.30 this morning to get down there to watch the boys crush it. Yeah, that's so, an understatement. Yeah. 30 strokes. And, uh, I'm usually 30 strokes over par if I play golf, <laughs> which is practically never. Par. But that might be that's why I'm always that far over. But anyway. Yeah, count 0-2. Still going. Congrats to the boys. The mm -hmm. girls will actually start their regional golf tournament tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So good luck to those ladies as they go. Yeah. And hope Wendy's, hope Wendy's watching because uh, – she said she would be watching Billy's Dot Live. Ah, uh, there you go. And speaking of Billy's Dot Live, mm -hmm. in just a few minutes um, at seven, I guess, unless they start early too. But the boys will be on Billy's Dot Live too. There you go. So there the boys go. are up at the hill, up the hill here in town. There you go. Uh, Billy's Live too. So if you want to tune in or know someone tuning in, you want to run more than one device? Go yeah, ahead. Yeah, heck Knock yeah. Your socks off. Do like we usually do. Have one on the living room and one on in the bedroom. <laughs> and go back and forth. 2-2 so, count here. Pitch again. Right, right down, down the two. pipe. There we go. So, Billy's leave one stranded here at bottom of the uh, – we'll be back here on Billy's.Live in just a moment for the bottom of the first. Arizona Plumbing, your full-service plumbing provider for the Fredericksburg community and beyond. We have the tools and experience for comprehensive residential and commercial plumbing, including everything from water filtration to drain services for new construction or even remodeling. Have an after hours emergency? No problem. Don't settle for less than the best. We're online at arizolaplumbing.com or give us a call at 830-998-4336. Deal. Hey, hey, there we go. A couple back. of good looking bloke right there. That's right. That's there must be somebody behind us. <laughs> <laughs> There's a reason for putting this on. Well, there you go, I'm sure. So, thanks for joining us this evening. Uh, like I say, we're getting started a little little early, earlier. Uh, they had uh, teacher appreciation night. Yes, they did. Teacher appreciation night. Oh, cool. Night. Seeing so, all the teachers coming out here supporting them girls. Oh, yeah. All the hard work. Oh, yeah. Let's take a look at our standings here real quick. Uh, your Billy's there at 9-0, and taking it in first place. Davenport coming in second, 7-2. and uh, Bernie and Wimberley tied at four and five each. I believe Bernie holds the tiebreaker because they beat Wimberley. Um, and then Kenny Lake, two and six. And then Bandera rounding it out there at 0 and eight down there at the bottom. We appreciate Howl Antiques for that uh, district standings. Yeah. Thank you guys. Betty and Gary Howell, thank you so much. Appreciate that. And as we're getting warmed up, we'll run through the uh, Billy's lineup. Get that up there and run through that for you guys here in just a second. There we Here go. We are. Number 19, Madison Wright, be catching Ava Stewie. Pitching, Brendel Wolf, third base, McKenna Dicker. Center field, Riley McGuffey, shortstop. Natalie Simmons will be right field. Sidney Meyer, first base. Bella Finley is our DP. 
and uh, Mari Silva. Second base, Robbie Griffin will be playing left field flex right there. So there we are. Bailey's got a great lineup and uh, ready to see something happen. If you did not see last Friday, Brindle back to back. Yeah. Home run. Yep. Same spot. Oh, yeah. That girl nailed two bombs. Yeah, she did. First two of the year. First two of the year. There you go. She said she liked the first one so much. She said, "I want to do oh, this God, again. I want to see if I can do it." Uh, there you, know. you go. There All you right, go. Here's Madison Wright, Lady Billy's stepping mm -hmm. in the box. Make it happen. Pitch. That's low. Low in there for ball one. Miss Kaylin Ortiz in the circle for Bandera. And be pitching to Hannah Wells behind the plate for your battery this evening. Oh, Maddie swings through <laughs> that one. She was she was looking she, at the fence on that one too. She was looking at she. Well, yeah. She had a she had a handful of good hits last Friday, mm -hmm. and uh, not normally anything that she's used to doing. But I mean, they were well needed hits. There you and, go. I mean, she put them in play and and put it where it needed to be. And was that before or after? Them girls. Here we are. Is that early replay? Hmm. Her eyes gotta are way up there. <laughs> gotta see it to hit it, kiddo. Gotta see it to hit it. But now, my question was last week after Talk you know the hits, mm -hmm. was that before or after she uh, tore open her finger on that uh, oh, that one? Oh yeah, pitch? she was worried about her fingernail. There's there it is. A shot. Go to right, deep right, deep right. Go on <laughs> in the highway. Woo! <laughs> Nice job. Took that outside pitch. Oppo. Find that in the Fredericksburg farm over there. Yeah, just like that. That's what that. she was looking for. Yeah, it was. She's like, my <laughs> finger don't hurt. What finger? What fingernail? Yeah. I don't need no stinking more. fingernail. <laughs> nice job, Maddie. Nice job. So just like that, Lady Billy's take the lead. One to nothing here in the bottom of the first. That's going to bring Ava Stewie to the plate. Our Sterling replay. Boop. Wow. Took that outside she pitch. She didn't even throw a whole lot of energy. You know, it's just bat meets ball. Yes. Well, you know. <laughs> that's all it takes. The simplest form of it, that's all it takes, yeah. Now, Ava Stewie steps in here, up one nothing. Oh, pitch is just a bit just, outside. Just a, just a little out. Have to catch her work a little bit. So, Lady Billies have, have wrapped up the district title. Uh, and so they, they will be they will finish the season in first place in district. So they will play the fourth place team in the by district round. And right now it is escaping me what district that would be. But I believe it's either going to be Navarro or Lavernia. Okay. Uh, for their uh, by district round uh, opponent. Perfect. Um, season ends today for most teams, um, but uh, doesn't officially end until uh, Friday. And they always build in that extra day to let everybody, you know, get a get an, a makeup game in there for weather, or if there's a tie in the playoffs, or you know, something oh, yeah. who's going to the playoffs, they can play that extra game. So yeah, we got to get that little extra. <laughs> oh yeah, we had some rain days. We've had some rain days. Oh heck yeah, <coughs> Stewie steps in with a 3-0 count here. Pitch yeah, outside, outside. outside. I don't think she wanted anything close. Uh, no. To be totally honest with you. No, but <laughs> if she's going to do that, she's going to walk the bases loaded. She don't want anything close to most of these girls. <laughs> True. <laughs> True. And I did hear that um, if the uh, girls do finish undefeated, um, all by district will be at home. Oh, really? No, I'm just kidding. I was going to say that wishful, would be very interesting. <laughs> wishful thinking. Right? Yeah, yeah. I, I bet We'd Navarro, have more Billy fans. <laughs> yeah, Navarro and Lavernia, whichever one, would probably have something to say about that. <laughs> no, do not believe anything that I just said. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Please. Yeah. Hopefully everything finishes up and then they can start oh. making phone calls and mm -hmm. flip coins and choose, you know, locations for playoff games and all that. And we'll get that information out to you as soon as we know. And I'm ready. Are you ready? Heck yeah. Let's travel. Heck yeah. It's uh, it's playoff season, baby. Here's my girl, Brenda Wolf. Back to back. Tell you, high school Last playoffs week. will start next week. College playoffs will start in a few weeks. Watched a bunch of college this weekend. Yeah. 3-0 count on Miss Brindle. Wait for that strike. Let's see here with the 3-0 count if he cuts her loose or tells her to hold off. 
I'd say if it was tight, I would just let her eat. <laughs> <laughs> well, she takes ball four. That's going to bring McKenna Dicker to the plate. McKenna is manning center field for the Lady Billies tonight on defense. So nobody out here. Runners at first and second. Runners on one and two. Ava on two. Waiting. She goes. And now we're moving off. Madison. See if they'll chase her. Everybody up. I'm sorry, Madison. Brindle. Got the double steal going there. So McKenna ahead here. 1 0. Pitch right Ooh, down. Pops that one Pop up. That and the shortstop makes the play. Ava's going to take. Advanced oh. home. They're going to go three. And then Brindle's able to Brindle. slide in yes. for the tag there to third. Great slide. Way nice in the job. back side of that bag. Get that outside corner and hold on. And not go past. <laughs> oh, yeah. you got to hug that bag. Here we go. Here's a replay of that hit. Ava tagged up. Brindle watched the play go home. And then she advances. Brings up Miss Riley McGuffey. For the Lady Billies. Outside. Runner on third. One away now. Pitch, here we are. Riley gets Takes into that, that one. Inside. Right fielder looks. Right oh. fielder. Wow, what a grab by right fielder. Brendel yeah. tags up and comes in home. So Riley's going to get the RBI on the sack fly. Right fielder wasn't too sure on that no. one. Looked, uh, no. thought maybe there for a second, it she might. That one might hit the ground. Yeah, it was taking a mad hook. It did take a mad hook. So that's going to be two away. But Lady Billy's got three on the board as Natalie Simmons steps to the plate. The Natalie can start us a two-out rally here. Mm -hmm. Bags are cleared. Here we go. Texas Leaguer drops in over there, there in front of is. right. Just enough for her to make a great base hit. Girls hold her at one. And here we are. We can get old Sydney Meyer. Number 20 coming in to do a little something. Knock Natalie around. There you go. Now we're going to move Natalie forward maybe even on that first pitch. Colorado sit, watching their first pitch outside. Miss Ortiz has kind of been living on that outside mm -hmm. corner most of the time. and But I guess I can't blame her because then when she brings it to the middle Too inside, far then inside. they, you know. Big they, things happen. Yeah, big things happen. Oh, fouls that one into the bullpen area over there. Got to make the count one and one. Pitch. See, it moves Natalie Ooh. on. Nobody yeah. in that area. No, oh, Natalie's going to get up. She's going to take third on the errant throw by the catcher. There you go. Pitcher Natalie and Coach Sherwin. Coach Tim Sherwin. Appreciate it. His dedication this year. Pitch. Oh, off the knee. That's knee gonna leave a mark. Off the knee. <laughs> the girls are up there with uh, three up. Bottom of the first inning replay on this uh, foul. Oh, 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 toe, toe, got the toe. Toe. There you go, toe Sid. Me. All right, get, oh. get, get, go, kid. Keep running, Sid. I would just try it. Let the big dog eat. They send her. Look at this. Windmill. Oh, oh and she's geez. under the tag. <laughs> nice job. Woo! Nice job. That was for all the marbles Heck right there. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. It feels good. Just, do it right there. 
see if we can get our yeah, sterling replay. replay on that oh, one. Yeah. Watch her all the way around. She doesn't let off the throttle one bit. Oh, no. Uh -uh. And here we are. Get out. <laughs> oh, a hard line drive by Bella Finley. Nice job, Bella. Yes. She's pushing. Oh, she's going to push take two. two. Yep. There perfect, we go. Perfect. Good job, Bella. Nice base running. Good. Quick look at Bella's hit here while we were watching Sid come all the way around the bags. Good hit by Bella. A little high line drive to shortstop. Just out of reach. Drop down second. Good job. Another one right to short. Oh. That one picked up. That will do it, but the Lady Billy is able to put five on the board in the bottom of the first. We'll Beautiful be, cricket letter. Heck yeah, I love those cricket letters. We'll be back on Billy's.Live here in just a moment. Top five reasons we love Gaddy's in Fredericksburg. Number five, their student teacher lunch discount. Number four, their all-you-can-eat buffet. Number three, they have a huge variety of fresh veggies at the salad bar. Number two, Gaddy's Pasta and Pizza is always hot and ready. And best of all, they even do the dishes. Gaddy's Pizza, Highway 16 South, across from the fairgrounds. Strayer and Offers has been going strong since 1928. They specialize in tires and tire repair, wheel balancing, front end alignment, brake repair, tune-ups, oil changes, belts and hoses, complete auto repair. Make sure you check out the Kawasaki Mules and custom-built trailers ready to go to work for you. For quality Chevron products, Strayer and Offers, 509 South Adams Street, Fredericksburg. Call 830-997-4382. Check them out online, strayeronoffers.com. Thanks for tuning in, Billy Nation. Tonight's coverage is brought to you by The Inside Story, helping you make your house your home. Segner's Jewelers, with locations in Fredericksburg and Bee Cave. Hill Country Propane, for all your outdoor grilling needs. The FISD Education Foundation, let's make FISD better together. Security State Bank and Trust, celebrating 82 years of serving Fredericksburg. Here, welcome back. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Got the ladies up here. First Miss batter, swinging a miss, a little low. Sarissa Fernandez. Yes. Uh, Bandera. We can go through their lineup real quick. Appreciate them girls visiting up here in Fredericksburg, hosting them. Grounds that one just foul. Down the right field. We got one defensive change to tell you about. We got Addison Chesso stepping into right field there for Miss Natalie Simmons. I believe that's the only change. It's kind of the way it's looking here. Yeah. The way it's holding. Every, everybody else looks familiar. Oh, Gets little that inside. Foot just out of the way. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. That's what y'all getting on the hard way when you take one off the toe like right that. But she right got that foot. Zink. Mm. Two two count. Nobody on, nobody out. Pitch strike. Swing and a miss. Change that. That's out number one. Very good. That is strikeout number four in the game for Miss Stewie. Swing straight through that one. That's going to bring number two, Bailey Word. Bailey Word. To the plate. Bailey's the second baseman for the Lady Bulldogs. He steps in, one away. Pitch, swings oh. around, bunt, and oh. almost. <laughs> that was almost. That, that was great hustle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm just glad neither one of them touched it. <laughs> if they'd have right. touched it, it, it would yeah. have been. It would have been. It was right inside I mean, that when it dropped. Good hustle. Just not enough time to. Oh. Yep, it, it dropped. It dropped. It oh. hit fair and went bloop. That's that spin. But good thing the ball Stayed foul and no collisions. True that. No collisions. That, we don't need yeah. any collisions. Pitch number two, another bunt, squares around. Brenda. Brenda was yeah. she was in her hip pocket yeah, that time. She was all over it. Uh, this is a little blooper. I got it. I'm gonna run through this one. Oh, 
Yeah, 0 2 count, one out. Ava going to work. Yes. Swing and a miss for strike three. That would be Miss Ava Stewie's 200th Number strikeout 200. for the season. Yes, sir. <laughs> So we're going to have a change. Looks like he's waving the Kenna Dicker in to pitch. Good job there, Miss Stewie. Congrats around by the fans and the teammates and whatnot. So strike out 200 on the season. Great job for her, young lady. Great job. So looks like we're going to tell you, we'll take a little break while we uh, settle all this out, who's going where, what changes are being made, and we'll be back in just a moment here on Billy's Dot Live. We've had grants on our campus such as a robotics club. We've had grants that had to do with technology and new things that we could offer the students. Grants for our garden club, which I'm really excited about to get our billies outside and thinking about farming and thinking about parts of a plan. And so a lot of our grants, what I'm noticing is there are things that really enhance what we're already teaching, but through a little bit of a different manner. All of that's due to the gracious donations from our community and every Everyone else that really supports our education foundation and it seems like it's really growing each and every year which is just going to allow more opportunities for our kids as we move forward in the future. Visit FISDKids.org to learn more. <laughs> We sure hope you're enjoying the coverage of today's game. And if you are, do us a favor. Be sure and thank DR Welding. Quality and craftsmanship make the difference. Texas Hill Country Orthopedics and Sports Medicine. Get your stride back. Arrowhead Bank. Financial services for the Hill Country since 1923. Arizona Plumbing. The Hill Country's number one plumber. And by J4 Trailers. That's where I got mine. All right, a few defensive changes here. Got a little shuffle the deck here a little bit. So we're going to have uh, freshman McKenna Dicker stepping into the circle to pitch. And she will be pitching to Mari Silva, which means Maddie Wright is shifting over to third base. And with Mari moving to catcher, that's going to put Bella Finley at second. And then Ava Stewie is going to shift out to center field to take McKenna's spot. Kyle, did we get them all? I think we got it, sir. Okay. All right. So next time, take a breath. Okay. All right. Sorry. <laughs> about so we'll go real quick. McKenna in the circle. Okay. Mari behind the plate, and you got Sid at first, Bella at second, Riley at the short, Madison in, at third, Robbie in left, Ava in center, and Addison Chasso in right. I believe is where we're at there right we now. There we are. There we are. And that's going to bring number twenty-seven, Tatum Miller, Mueller, Moeller. Sorry, I can't even read my Tatum writing. Tatum Yep. Third Tatum base, playing third. Yeah. Looks like Bandera here tonight. Looks at first pitch for ball one. All right, swing, got it. Come on, take it, take it. You make a difference. Give today, FISDkids.org slash donate. Appreciate that, FISD Education Foundation. We appreciate all the work that they do. Swing and a miss there for strike one. Makes that it all possible for our teachers. That's going to say that education foundation, they don't strike out. No. 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 no, no they no, hit no. home runs all the time. <laughs> you got that right. Again, you've seen all them, uh, all the teachers here for the uh, teacher appreciation. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, administration appreciation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that one is right at her eyes, the catcher's eyes. Yeah. And uh, fouls this one back. Just and to the, above hey, the concession Kyle, stand. the concession stand is open this Speaking evening. of the concession stand. It is right. open this Popcorn evening. Popcorn and hot dogs. Popcorn. Uh, no, Frito pie. Mm. Oh, the hot Cheeto Ooh, nachos. Yes, yes. Hot Cheetos with chili and cheese. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. We were just informed <laughs> that we are wildly mistaken. It the is, concession stand is closed. closed down. Hmm. <laughs> That's too bad. Yeah, There's a bunch hard, of people out hard. here that are wanting to get Frito pie. I could use yeah, the hot Cheeto. Hot Cheeto Frito pie. Mm, right you darn right. <laughs> oh well, not tonight. I guess I'll just have to go to go Whataburger home. on the way home. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Wait, can I say that? I don't know. Are they a sponsor? They're not sponsoring you. Oh, man. We're working on it. Oh, she fouls this one right back, back here again. into the concession stand that's closed. <laughs> Sorry, do I sound do I sound irritated by that? <laughs> right over there, my page's head. He would have stuck his head out the trailer door. It would have been. He right, could have caught it right one-handed. Here we are. Count All right, we're gonna get full. back full count here. Two outs here, Lady Billies, working hard. Working off Bandera. Put another and zero. Got she that goes one. There Amen. we go. Swing Her first miss. K of the night. There you go. So, Lady Billies, we'll be back. With sticks in hand here in just a moment on Billy's Dot Live. Ooh, man. You're playing like a new player since your hip surgery. I'm telling you, Texas Hill Country Orthopedics and Sports Medicine has changed my life. I lived with the pain of that old football injury for years. Never thought I'd walk right again. They did this minimally invasive procedure thing. Really sped up my recovery faster than I ever imagined. Man, I've been struggling with this old tennis elbow for years. I wonder if they could help me out. Absolutely. They work wonders. Texas Hill Country Orthopedics and Sports Medicine, getting you back in the game of life. My name is David Smith, Fredericksburg FBO. This business has done now five large metal buildings through Donnie Ray. He is honest, enormously competent in the matter of metal buildings. He's been doing metal buildings for 35 years. Service is excellent. The work is reliable, and they're fast. Now, these are the qualities that will come through and deliver value. Welcome to Creek Street Dental, where we strive to treat our patients with compassion, kindness, and care. We utilize the latest technologies in our commitment to your family, offering cone beam technology, cosmetic dentistry, and sedation dentistry so you can sleep through your appointment. Stop by and meet our newest addition, Dr. Monica Montgomery from the Fredericksburg High School class of 2014. Creek Street Dental on the corner of Creek Street and South Adams in Fredericksburg. And we are back here, ladies and gentlemen. Lady Billy's up five to nothing. The uh, top of the second inning, Miss Ava Stewie got her 200th strikeout of the season. And uh, then was a uh, little congratulations by the team, got to keep the game ball, and then uh, they brought in McKenna Dicker. So it looks like Miss Dicker will finish the game out the rest of the way. And on the batting side of things, Madison Wright's starting us off. So we're back at the top of the order. A one and one count after that outside pitch. Two one. Sorry, two, two one. one. Two one. That's right. That's all right. Yeah, we came in just a little late. Appreciate them people at Creek Street. Uh, Creek Street. <laughs> <laughs> that's a hard one <laughs> to where, say. Yeah, that's where I got mine. Yeah. <laughs> yes, Creek Street Dental. Yeah. So we appreciate Thank all our guys. sponsors, especially. Oh, I mean, our scoreboard sponsor there, Warner Electric. I mean, there, there you go. You know, he's able to keep everybody in uh, a, little, a little high in there. It's going to be ball four. So the leadoff is on with a walk. That's going to bring Ava Stewie to the plate. Madison with a home run, first at bat, and then uh, second was a walk. Mm -hmm. Ava walked in her first at bat and see if they – maybe they switch maybe it up. swap it up here. Another high outside that – Kind of at the same placement as Ava's was. <laughs> All four pitches uh, mm -hmm. last at bat for Ava. <laughs> Ava steps in, hoping to get something to swing at. Pitch outside again. Maybe she goes in that left-handed box. You know, I wonder if she jumps from one side of the box to the other side of the box, does a pirouette to spin. Mm -hmm. And then bats left hand. A promenade. A promenade. There yeah. you go. Mm -hmm. There you go. High outside yeah. moves Madison. She's going to move on the wild pitch to second. So 3 0 count here to Miss Stewie. Madison Wright standing safely at second base after her leadoff walk. Just doesn't sound as glorious as a leadoff home run. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, she brought in a little bit. Not quite enough, though. Is that ball four? So Brenda Wolf will step to the plate. Turns it first and second. Nobody out here. Lady Billy's up five to nothing. In this final game of district. And 
ball one. Rendell steps in, hoping for something to swing at. Pitch. Yeah, she gets Stop. under that one a little bit. Way high center. Riley Smith underneath that one to bring it in for out number one. Brings up McKenna Dicker. Niner Niner. Brings her to the plate. She can't push these two runners around with one out. No. See if she can. She got a sack fly in her last at bat. Let's see if she can find some green out there and get an R, another RBI get this, out of the deal. Get it to drop out. And the outside oh. pitch. Oh, and the throw is offline just a little bit. So Madison gets second. And Ava moves. I'm sorry, she gets third, and Ava moves to the second. Just like that, two runs, 180 feet. Now she can get her a sack fly. Feet. Outside for ball. Fly now. Ava might be able to catch Madison on a sack fly. Might. <laughs> Madison would probably beat her by a step. And fouls out of right field there. Mm. Mm. Yeah. And McKenna's like, please, please give me something. That one. <laughs> oh, oh, that one's inside. And Madison comes across to score, and Ava takes third. Who's Ava over to three, waiting patiently. McKenna sitting in at one ball, um, two balls, two strikes now. And she McKenna hits that one. Over the right. Right, the right fielder Can't struggles reach. that one. Mm -hmm. McKenna's on her horse. She's coming around. She's going third. Looks like Sherwin's going to send her home. Send her. And now she's in a pickle. Oh, and the ball gets past home. third baseman. <laughs> and she will score. Oh, good job. Wait a good heads up base run in there. Saw that ball come in in her peripheral, and she put the brakes on. Pickle didn't work that time. Speaking of pickle. <laughs> no, the concession stand is tonight. closed. Not available tonight. Oh, that's going to bring Riley McGuffey to the plate. Lady Billy's up eight to nothing here. Bottom of the second with one away. Bases are now empty. See if Riley can get us another round of runs going here. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. One out here. Billy's can definitely plenty of time yet. We are pitch delivered inside low. Good eye, kiddo. And uh, really appreciate Howl's Antiques. Don't mind, uh, thank you guys for... Being there, being a little pop-up sponsor, we appreciate them. Yeah, let's send a peek into Howl Antiques. Thank you guys so much. Howl's Antique Shop, battling Billy supporters and established antique dealers for over 30 years. Red Baron Antique Mall. and They've got the goodies, yes. I'm telling you. Oh. If you're looking for it, they got it. And if they don't, they know where to get it. Mm. I don't know. I didn't even see did, if it said on there or not. I was trying to read it all. <laughs> How many square feet of antiques they got? You know, I, I don't know. I wonder know. what that number would be. Inside, outside, anything available. Where they're at. I wonder if Betty could come up with that for us. We'll see if my phone starts buzzing. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate them guys over there. Oh, heck Thank yeah. you all so much. Big, big Billy fans, big sports fans. Miss Betty has an itinerary. Oh, really? Yes, and she will have on there. She's got. Uh, oh, there it is, deep there's shot. There's a gapper right down the center of uh, between. That's going to get her at least center. two. 
And she's, she's going, going to go for three. three. And, and oh, balls does loose, not hold on. She's safe. Wow, I'm glad that ball came out. Oh, yeah, she mm. was toast. But uh, they, the third baseman wasn't able to, to squeeze it. Mm, so nice solid enough. contact, though. Yes. She waited mm. on it. She got the meat of the barrel on it, drove it into the gap. Yeah, she's been due for that. She's been doing some big leaguers and some nice good base hits. But, uh, yeah, it looks like actually the collision kind of knocked the ball out of the glove. Like she oh, didn't yeah. quite have it tight enough. Mm. Catch, cover, tag. Mm -hmm. So, that is going to bring Addie Shesso, number two, to the plate Old here. wheels. Outside. Just outside. Good eye kid. There you go. Ball one. Oh, yeah. Love some Addie Shesso on the run in the bases. The, well, look at the, I mean, We're you got, always look surprised. at the two. I mean, you got <laughs> these the two here. These yeah. two here are fun to watch on the bags. They're like twins oh, on speed. And Riley's going to yeah, score on the right uh, on wild through. pitch. Speaking of Riley, heck of a job doing the national anthem. Tonight. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, man. Heck yeah. She did a great job. Wish you guys wouldn't have been able to be here to hear that. She did a great job. She did the national anthem for one of the basketball games, I believe, earlier in the year True. as well, if True I that. remember correctly. True that. Yeah, she always does a good job with it. You know, I know you're not going to toot your own horn, but your young lady also does a heck of a job <laughs> with that national anthem. She can belt oh, it out you. there as well, Miss JC. The old Turk. Turk, yep. Thank you. You know, she does, uh, I think, 4-H tomorrow. Okay. Talent contest tomorrow. Oh, very cool. 4-H, so we'll see what happens there. Nice. Very nice. Hard There's hit. a shot back up the middle. Nice. Good job, Addy. Mm -hmm. is, uh, Addy is probably one of the, uh, one of the highest on-base percentage of the team. Yeah, she, she finds her way on base real regular. And the Bandera coach is coming out. We're gonna have a chat. Looks like let's see if Slow we're gonna have a, down a little bit. Tell you what, we're gonna take a quick break. We'll be right back Why in just a moment on Billy's Dot Live. Hello, my name is Greg Nebgen with 4N Cattle Company. I want to talk to you a little bit about J4 trailer and my experience. So I was looking for a new cattle trailer. Stopped by, talked to Josh, customized what I wanted. I own a local business. I want to do my business local. Prices were very competitive. I looked at trailers everywhere. They were $1,000 cheaper, if not more. I was going to buy local anyway. They beat everybody in price. And then they even delivered it. J4 trailer, that's where I got mine. All right, we're back. No changes. Just a, uh, a powwow. Just a powwow. That's going to bring Sydney Meyer to the plate. She reached on an error in her first at bat. She got speed on first. Oh, yeah. And she's going to stand Addie. up and take second, no problem. I would have seen that catcher was throwing. She probably would have gone. She to could third. have turned, yeah. <laughs> Never hit the brakes. 1 0 here to Miss Sid. Colorado oh, State. Look at this. It's look at this. Gonna hook foul. Oh, just a little too much English. Mm. Mm. Too much Colorado. Yep. The Lady Billy's put four on the board this inning. They were able to put five in the first. So looking to uh, at least duplicate that here with one away and a runner at second base. And she is nice. going to third. Third, Addison Sesho. Nice job. Another stolen base for Addie. Lays down safely. And she wanted to make sure somebody had to wash that uniform. <laughs> Mama. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah that that steel ball was. I mean, what? <laughs> yeah, she got a good jump. <laughs> she got a real good jump. Three. A ground ball. Oh, check. Over to first, and Addie's going to score. So. A ribby for Miss Sydney Meyer. We'll take it. Nine on the board. Bottom of the second. We got ten. Ten runs here. Bella Fidney, like Brad said. Yeah, and Miss Bella had a nice shot back up the middle. Amen. And her first at bat. Just out of the reach of shortstop. Mm-hmm. Solid and, contact. Uh, she got got double out of it. Yes, she did. Yeah, she did. And the 
pitch. There it yeah. is. Look Pokes at this. That Texas one in the right field. Drop there it. we go. Mm -hmm. Nice little soft line drive. Oh, a lot of grass. I'll tell you what, I'll take 10 or 15 of those every game. True. I'll take them every game. Nice job of hitting there, young lady. I believe the boys are 0 0 still. <laughs> yeah, after, after, the, the, after first, the first. Yeah. Look at Bella poking that little outside pitch just over second base there. Nice job. That is going to bring uh, your new catcher, Mari Silva, to the plate. Outside, Bella's Bella. taking Huge second. Jump. Didn't yeah? She's like, I'm not going to get there. Yeah, she might have been a changeup, even a little off speed. I think tried to get Mari on, and that's what made Bella look like she got such a jump on it. Make the count one and one. Two away here. Lady Billy's put five up in each inning so far. We've got Bella Finley over there at second. Mari pops that one up, and the pitcher's able to get underneath it for out number three. So, Cobra and Copy repeat from the first inning. Five runs, five runs. So, your Lady Billy's have a 10 0 lead as we go to the top of the third here on Billy's.live. At the Real Estate Advisory Team, we know the Texas Hill Country, and we know Texas Hill Country real estate. With the Real Estate Advisory Team, you'll have a team of experienced local professionals who value honesty and integrity and work tirelessly to help you achieve your real estate goals. Give us a call or stop by today. We would be honored to help turn your Texas Hill Country dream into a reality. Go Billies! Billy Nation, we couldn't do it without the help of our sponsors, like the Real Estate Advisory Team, your source for Hill Country Real Estate, Security State Bank Wealth Management, your plan, your goal, your purpose, Strayer and Offers, serving the Hill Country since 1928, Creek Street Dental, treating patients with care and compassion, Gaddy's Pizza, pizza, games, and party rooms. And we are back here getting ready to start at the top of the third inning. Does not look like we've had any additional defensive changes from what we had last inning. We can go over them real quick. You got McKenna Dicker in the circle, Mari Silva behind the plate, Sydney Meyer at first, Bella Finley at second, Riley McGuffey at short, and Madison Wright at third, Robbie Griffin in left, Ava Stewie in center, and Addison Shesso in right field. So Lady Billy's been able to put five up each inning here as we uh, move into the third. Uh, again, uh, Lady Billy's have locked up the district title. They're looking to complete a uh, clean sweep of the district tonight. Things continue as they are. We should end up with a 10-0 district record. Low in there for ball one. I think that's the uh, first time that they've uh, there's been a 10-0 record in district since uh, 21. I think was the, the most recent year that we went 10-0. So sweet. Low for ball two. Now I'm not trying to put the cart before the horse or anything, but no. <clears throat> So we'll see if McKenna can get back in here. She's a little, ahead, a little behind right now in the count. That one must have been a little high. <laughs> that was at her eyes. Yeah. I, Catcher's I, I just right uh, I was. Okay, yeah, okay. It that was. one was high. That one's legit. It. That All one's right. legit. Uncle. Okay. Okay. We'll give on that one. That Got that one. Good. There we go. Great pitch. Great right pitch. on that inside corner there. All them replays, we appreciate Sterling Real Estate. Yes. Absolutely. Miss Tanya White Chambers over there, uh, owner, uh, accomplished realtor here in Fredericksburg, Texas. Appreciate them uh, doing our replays. And uh, recognized for exceptional knowledge, dedication, and personal approach. We appreciate it for them uh, helping us out. Yeah, Miss Tanya, they, they also are the sponsor for the post-game interview with uh, – Kerry Burgess. All right. Yeah. Came back from a 3-0 yeah, count to get that. her looking. That's what, what we deal, like to what see. You go touch the back real quick. 
There you go. One away here. And it's going to bring number three, Hannah Wells, the catcher, to the plate for the Lady Bulldogs. All right. Uh, also, another quick little peek in here right after this pitch with Diamond W Specialty. Swing and a miss. Diamond W Specialties, a cut above the rest. Go, Billy! Awesome. Appreciate it, Tim. Swing and a miss for strike two. Helping the girls and the boys. On, uh, sponsoring them. And it got her pitch ready to deliver. Little low. Touch low. That's a good 0-2 pitch, though. That's a good 0-2 pitch. Low and a little away. It's one of those that, uh, you know, if the hitter's behind in the count, sometimes they'll chase. And if they do make contact, they ain't going to do much with it. Oh, shot. Just foul. Count's going to remain one and two. Rips that yeah, inside pitch, she boy. Pulls that sucker real hard. Here we are. Oh. High outside. Just a bit outside on that one. Mm -hmm. Two two the count. Good oh, Mari made it look like it was further than it was. Oh, is that what she was doing? Yeah. Okay. Okay. She was dramatizing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there we go. Girls. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice How's touch. Back? How's it back? So as we had said earlier, the boys are playing up top, up the hill. Uh, last time we had checked in, it was 0-0 after 1. Uh, they're on Billy's Live 2 this evening, so at the conclusion of this game, you can uh, switch over. Fouls that one off. Switch over and watch the boys' game. Tune in and check them out as well, or do like we do at our house. Just play know, both of them. Play both of them at the same time. You just bounce back and forth from room to room. And see, the nice thing is with at our house, you know, from one room to the next room, you walk right by the kitchen. So the concession stand is always open at our house. The concession stand is <laughs> yes, always, always open. open. The fridge is always open. Yes. Now, whether it has food in it or not, that's <laughs> that's a whole other situation. Swing there you go. and Swing a and miss. miss. Yeah, strike three, look, uh, swinging. Let's see here. Here we are, ladies. Sterling replay. Sink. Like, nope. Sorry, coach. Strikeout number three for Miss Dicker. I thought that's what that was. This yeah, number one, Miss Riley Smith, uh, leadoff, st stepping in. There, hit to Madison. Bounce that one to Madison over. Picks it up. Nice. Yeah. Nice 6-3 nice, nice to end the inning. Nice control. Yeah. So, Lady Billies will be uh, back in just a moment with sticks in hand as uh, they take the lead here 10-0 against Bandera on Billies.Live. Arrowhead Bank is celebrating 100 years of serving the Hill Country. Their goal is to greet you by name when you walk in the door and provide you the banking help you need today. You're guaranteed to speak to someone you know when you pick up the phone. Arrowhead Bank wants to thank all the employees of Fredericksburg ISD. Good luck to the Batlin Billies in all activities this school year. Arrowhead Bank, 502 South Adams, 830-990-9300. Check them out online, arrowheadbanktexas.com. We hope you're enjoying this broadcast, and if you are, be sure to thank these fine sponsors. Joseph Financial Partners, assisting every aspect of your financial life. Tanya White Chambers and the Sterling Real Estate Group. Votive Hospice, Small Town Heart, Generations of Care. Hill Country Refrigeration, quality heating and air in the Hill Country. And by the FISD Education Foundation. Let's make FISD better together. And we are back. Bottom of the third inning here. And it looks like we're at the top of our order again. Madison Wright coming to the plate. You know, so we started the first inning with Madison. True. We started the second inning with Madison. Yes, we did. So Can we do it again? Yeah, let's do it again. What the heck? 
So we're going to start it with her in the third inning. With? Madison Wright. There it is. Number one nine. Shifted from catching over to third with yes. that final third out at the uh, top of the third inning, of course, just moments ago. Outside there called strike one. Maddie homered in her first at-bat. True. And then walked on four straight pitches in her second at-bat. <laughs> Outside there for ball one. Speaking of liking that, you know, it's really easy. Like, subscribe, and get notified. Oh. Uh -huh. Really? Yes, it's real simple. Very simple? Absolutely. You go on there, the YouTube right there, you can look in the bottom top corner right here. We're going to show it on our banner there. You get a like, you know, subscribe, and then the little ringy dingy. They turn those notifications on, so anytime there's a Billy's Live event. Here we go, Ooh, pop up. It's going to be one. between them. Yep, right in that between one's going to fall. Madison's She's pushing for second. <laughs> So she gets a double in her third at bat. Drops a little, little fly ball out there between right field and left field. That's going to bring Ava Stewie to the plate, and she is 0 for 0 today. I believe she's walked on eight straight pitches. Eight straight eight pitches. Eight straight pitches. And they were all outside. Mm -hmm. And I would not be the least bit surprised if they put anything within her 72-inch reach. She just takes a hack. There. As I said. Right to short. <laughs> Hard and short. Reels it in, and, and she's, she's safe, safe at first. Madison rolls to three, and, and there Ava's goes Ava to second. There you go. That is base running. <laughs> it's here. Oh, over the top of the catcher, Madison holds up. Ball does a wicked bounce there against the backstop. It holds Madison up a little bit and gives her to stay on third. Wait for something happen off the bat. There you go. That's what I'm talking about, Brennell. There's like that. a shot. That's like going to that. be over the. Like that. No! Yeah. Drop just shy. That's going to bring in two, and two Brennell here. Brennell's going to stay, stay at two. second. There you go. Nice double there, Miss Wolf. Great shot, Brennell. Brings up our own Your pitcher, McKenna Dicker. And there you go. Mm. Good shot of Miss Wolf oh, over there yeah. at second base. McKenna got a triple in her last at bat. Ooh, she and hits that one ooh. past the shortstop. And then Brindle rounds and holds it third. Shortstop got a glove on it, just wasn't able to come up clean with it. So we got E6 there. It's the only thing that held Brindle on third was that. Oh, yeah. If it gets through, she's touch. scoring. Mm -hmm. The little glove touch is all of the Took the holder there. Runners on the corners. Riley McGuffey. Kenna. Take second. Mm -hmm. Defensive indifference there for Miss McKenna. It's a 1 0 here to Miss Riley. She also had a triple in her last at bat. Oh, Ooh, Hits yeah. that one up into the. Tight to the hands. There you go. And Too Riley high. Smith comes up firing to play at the plate. And they get her. Ah. So <laughs> Riley Smith comes up firing after catching that fly ball and is able to get the outfield assist on the out at Brenda Wolf at home. Good chunk there. Yeah, there you are, kid. That was a good chunk. Good mm -hmm. job right. keeping her feet moving. Mm -hmm. It looks like we got Natalie Simmons re-entering the game. Coach came in, do a little swap, a little change. So Natalie is re-entering for Addison. Natalie started in right field. So she's coming back in to get an at bat here. And she got a single in her first at bat. Punched one into that left center field gap out mm -hmm. there. Outside for ball one. 
So two away here. Lady Billies have two on the board. They're in danger of breaking their streak of scoring five runs every inning. In a dangerous streak. Yes, yes. Two outs with that double play that just happened. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. So 2 0. Miss Ortiz has been in the circle for Bandera all the way through. And a oh, hard oh, hit that's off the Ortiz glove. Ortiz just out of the glove. Nice job. Second base able to back him up. Take a quick look on what's next here. Billy's that live. Next up, number 20, Sidney Meyer. We have, uh, on the 26th, we got uh, Billy's Live 2. It's going to be baseball versus Davenport. There you and go. Then, uh, okay, only if there's a game at the same time will be a Billy's uh, Live 2. But uh, April the 26th, we got a shot. We'll get right back to that. There you go. Shot over here to the left. Natalie comes in to third. Natalie up. Great hit by Miss Colorado Sid. There you go. Nice double to the gap. Mm -hmm. And there we go. April the 25th. 26 on FBG.live. All right, we got Robbie Griffin stepping into bat here for Miss Bella Finley. So we got a pinch hitter. Robbie stepping in. So runners at second, third. Bam! Look at that. Got that barrel on it. Stayed on that inside pitch and got her hands out there Good early shot. enough to drive it. So runners at second, third here with two away. Robbie Griffin. Stepping in, see if you can find some green out there, kid. I bet you can score two. Mm, pretty quick. <clears throat> if memory serves correct, that would be a walk off. There, that down. could be uh, it. Nope. Caught. Riley's yeah, there. She's under it. Yep, she's under it for out that number three. Two. Oh, held us only three runs at any. Billy's up, 13 0. After the three innings, we'll be right back. Billy's dot live, top of the four. Segner's Jewelers is a proud Battle and Billy sponsor and big fans of our hometown team. Segner's has served generations of FISD families and friends and will be here to serve future generations. Located at 236 West Main Street or find us on the web at segnersjewelers.com. We're with you all the way. Go Billy's. It's grilling time at Hill Country Propane, Inc., and we've got the latest models of stainless steel grills made in America. Our showroom is full of grills by Wilmington, AOG, Fire Magic, and Phoenix. We offer Primo ceramic grills and pellet grills by Smokin' Brothers. Summertime is the time to celebrate grilling for family and friends. Come on in today and let our experienced team demonstrate features of the grill you deserve. Hill Country Propane, Inc., go propane. Hello friends, this is Shane Fronson from The Inside Story. We'd like to thank you, our Ferksburg community, for trusting us with all your home decorating needs. Whether wood or tile floors, window treatments or wallpaper, vinyl plank or paint, for 43 years now, you've made us the number one rated store in the area. And we couldn't be prouder to back our Billies right here on Billies.life. Thank you, Fredericksburg, for choosing The Inside Story. Drop by today and let us help make your house a home. That was great. See all them strikeouts there on Miss Ava reaching her 200th strikeout. That is an amazing work. And uh, McKenna's following her up here with how many strikeouts do we She's have? She's got three, so far. three, three so, so far. Three so far. This game. This yes, game. This she game. has an, uh, an outstanding year also with Kay's uh, lined up too. But uh, Ava's done a wonderful job for Lady Billies. And hopefully we can go a lot further yet. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, besides the pitching. 13 on the board and three innings. Uh, the bats are moving, buddy. The bats are on fire. There we go. Swing and a miss for strike two. 2-2 two, two count. All 
Bauer sizing up. Pitch delivered. Ooh, fouls fouls it over here to the right side. McKenna working. <laughs> here we are. You can hear Steve Miller, can't you? Yes, I can. That's why you're giggling. I knew yes, it. Yes, I can. Steve Miller. <laughs> Huge Billy fan. Miller time. Pitch right here. Ooh, yeah. Just oh. off that outside corner. He's going to bring Woo. the count full. Just my thought. Yep. Yep. Got her yep. looking. There we go. All right, quick again. We're right back here on what's next is uh, Billy's Baseball versus Davenport. Now, they're Billy's Live 2. Is that right, Brad? Okay. What, if. If they're playing on the 26th at the same time as the softball game. So if there's a playoff game on the 26th, then the playoff game for the girls will be on Billy's, Billy's Live. Live. The baseball game will be on Billy's Live, too. too. All right. So if. a little confusing, but take a snapshot of that screen, and that'll help remind you. We've got one right here in our pocket. But, uh, yeah, take a screenshot of that. Rewind it. That way you do have it. Uh, yeah, we definitely want to get them girls out there, along with the boys. Ye ask and ye shall receive, Kyle. What did we receive? Oh, square Red footage. Red square Got footage that. after this pitch. We'll, uh, <laughs> we'll cover that. <laughs> it's always good to talk about square uh, footage. In there for strike square two. Footage. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So, per Miss Betty Howell chiming in as watching the broadcast, per she always does, uh, per Jay Loving and his lovely wife, Cynthia, they are the owners of the Red Baron Antique Mall. Mm -hmm. 10,000 square feet of 10, antiques. 10,000. I asked, how many square foots? There you go. That's a lot of 10, foots. 10,000 square footses. That's a lot of footses. Ooh. So, yes, so the Lovings, Jay and Cynthia, the owners of the Red Baron Antique Mall, and uh, Howells, as well as several other people, have bukus of antiques in there to the tune of <laughs> 10,000 square footes. That's the muchos. That's a lot. Thank you. Thank you, Miss like Betty. That. We yeah. like those little facts like that. Oh. Thanks, Betty. All right. Pitch here, 2-2 two -two count. Oh, fouls it back. Yeah, our quick word from our Howells antiques. Might as well. Thank you, Betty. Howells Antique Shop. Batlin Billy supporters and established antique dealers for over 30 years. Betty and Gary. There you go. Thank Great you people. Great people. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hard, hard miss. Yeah. That, that's uh, it just uh, or did. Or a good miss? Well, Which way are we going with it? It Depends nibbled. On your count. It nibbled. It <laughs> nibbled and didn't quite. Well, okay, it was a little bit more outside than I thought. But it had some good movement on it, it and uh, she did not chase. So. That was good on ball. Oh, this one's up. up. Sid's Sid coming in, crashing. Chase. Nice it. job, Woo! Sid. There we go. Good job, Sid. Yeah. Great job sealing that. Here, out number two. She covered some ground and was watching for that that the yes. fence and the pole and everything right there. The I fence mean, was coming close. Yeah, it was. It was creeping in quick. Tight, 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 tight. Burp. That is a special runs Burp. out of the dugout. <laughs> Woo! <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> kind of love these girls have for each other. Oh, yeah. This is fun. Number four, Caitlin, or uh, Caitlin Ortiz stepping to the plate. With 2 -0. Oh. One count here. Ooh, oh, chasing that outside curveball. She didn't want it. So, 0 oh, 2 the count here with two outs. So, coach is talking to his hitter. And Miss Dicker's got her pitch call. Looking to see where we end up here. Just yeah, a bit outside. Just a bit. So, nice packed house here this evening. Oh, yeah. Final home game, lots of fans, you know, here. We got lots of Little League players here watching games. We got parents, we got fans. 
Oh, by the numbers. Oh, McKenna just reaches up and, and snags, snags that one. <laughs> yeah, look, at that. look, at, look that at that crowd. crowd. Look at Ooh, all those look people. Look at all that red and white. Boy, go I tell Billy's. you what, that's, that's awesome to see. That is awesome to see. So we'll be back in just a moment on Billy's.Live. Security State Bank and Trust is a proud supporter of our local athletes. Whether it's on or off the field, game day or any day, they're here to help you succeed and tackle your financial goals. From personal and business banking to mortgage services or trust services, Security State Bank and Trust can support all your banking needs, helping build communities we call home since 1941. Security State Bank and Trust, proud sponsors of Batlin Billy Sports. Let's go Billies! Member FDIC, equal housing lender. It's a high fly ball back deep at the wall. It's a uh, nope, short and caught for out number three. No one wants to come up short, especially with your retirement plan. Have you practiced the soft toss enough to smash the home runs? If you don't have all your bases covered with retirement, college savings, life insurance, and long-term care, call Joseph Financial Partners. We'll go around the horn and get your team ready for the big game. Call 830-997-4763 or online at josephfinancialpartners.com. Securities are offered through LPL Financial Member for this event. Since 1974, Hill Country Refrigeration has been bringing something extra to every residential customer, besides a cozy and comfortable home. It's built into every heating or air conditioning service. It's part of every estimate. You'll feel it in our handshakes. We carry it with us in our trucks, and it's forever in our hearts. It's our deep love for this community, and of course, our Batlin Billies. All right, here, just in time. First pitch here to Miss Mari. Catch him here. Heck, yeah. So, you know, Kyle, the interesting thing is, you know, we've got like 600 people here in the stands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? If you carry the one. If you carry the one. I always forget. I, I, yeah, I forget to take guy. the right shoe off. Yeah. Um, but with that being said, there – on top of all the people who are here watching in person, there's been a little over 240, 250 people viewing online this evening. So <laughs> if that gives you an idea. That's how, almost a thousand. That's, uh, you know, how <laughs> popular. Well, let me, let, me, let me change that. Let me correct that. Okay. It's not how popular. It's how well supported Billy's Nation is oh. of their players and their sports. Oh, absolutely. They come out in person. Mm -hmm. They come out online. If there's an opportunity to watch, they're going to watch. And the great thing for myself, I've got family who live out of town who don't always get to come to a game. So they get to watch these games, you know, when they can. I've, you know, I've got a sister who lives two and a half hours from here. You know, I mean, it's aunts and uncles that live, you know, around the coast and whatnot. And everybody's got family spread out. And so it's, it's a great way for – everybody to be able to get in there and support the billies yeah, absolutely it's great uh great to have that option oh heck great yeah to have that option. heck yeah so we got butts in the seats and eyes on the screen eyes on the screens and the open concession stand at home there you go amen and you didn't see mari stealing she did uh end up going to first on four straight pitches that were balls yes. and yeah you know, miss mari uh, she was she was something Smoke flying off the shoes, Madison up, 1-1 one, one count. And you know, uh, we should get, at her bat. We should get a T-shirt made. Butts in the seats, eyes on the screen, and on the back, concession stands always open. Concession stands always <laughs> open. <laughs> you think we get a sponsor Doors for that? Doors are open, maybe. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Oh, oh, oh. Looking with that. Oh, Inside. season open. There you go. So she's going to advance on the three. Uh, on the wild pitch there. Again, uh, definitely stay tuned after the game uh, for the uh, the post game, sponsored by Sterling Real Estate uh, Real Estate Group. Kerry Burgess will be on the mic. We'll see if we can keep him under 22 minutes this time. There you go. There you go. As long as he doesn't start talking about the weather, he's usually <laughs> okay. The weather. Dr. Doppler. There you go. That one's out in the back right by Paige. Better not hit my transformer. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two count now. Miss Silva over at third base. Maddie, chance to bring her in here. Looking for something to hit. The pitch. Right down the middle. Drives that one in the 5 Good 6 job. hole. There we go. Nice hit. Waiting for that cutoff to grab the ball. I believe she would have tried to. Here we go. No outs. One run in, 14 0. 
Madison right on first. Nice job. Yeah, nice hard crank. Right through that 5-6 hole. And she's going to steal second. About hit her in the noodle. Might have knocked some sense in her. You know. I, That's what her, dad would have said. I was going to say her dad would agree with you. <laughs> her dad would agree with you. Oh, no. Madison. Hard worker, smart runner. Love to have her here. Ava's waiting for that strike. Yeah, still. she is. She, she still hadn't seen one. <laughs> not yet. No, she hadn't. Well, that's not true. She did get a single in her last at bat. She, she finally found a pitch that was close enough in the yeah, zone for her to was, swing at. It was in the area. Yes, it was in Same the area code. So, but quickly up 2-0 here. Lady Billy's up 14 to nothing. We get one more across, and that will be ball game. And that's like gonna, this, right that's here. That's going to do it. That'll do it. Madison will come so in. She's going to get a double on that. That is going to bring Madison home. And that, ladies and gentlemen, will be your ball game. But don't go anywhere. We've got our Sterling Real Estate post-game show over here with Carrie Burgess. So we're going to go to ads, I guess. Yeah. Well, Lady Billy's finished the season 10-0 and district champs as they go out to shake hands and whatnot. Got a 10 and 0 season record, a uh, district record with a now 29 and 5 season record. 29 and 5. 29 and 5. Amazing. Going into mm -hmm. going into the playoffs. So, yeah, we'll catch a catch a little break here, get a few ads, and then uh, after they do the all modern whatnot, we'll get Kerry Burgess all set up and see if he can see if we, we can take numbers on how long his yeah. interview is going to be. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. By squares. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> By some squares. <laughs> no, again, stay tuned and uh, keep in contact with friends and family on uh, By District Game and where we're going to be broadcasting, when and where. Yes, exactly. Pre appreciate it, guys. Thank you all for tuning in. and uh, We'll be back in just a bit on Billy's.Live. Support for the Billies comes from Knopp Healthcare and Votive Hospice, family owned by Fredericksburg natives. Knopp's currently has Fredericksburg's best star rating on Medicare. We'd like to thank the people of Fredericksburg for voting us best of 2023 in the newspaper's Reader's Choice Awards. Knopp's won a total of five categories, including best nursing home, best assisted living, and best physical therapy. Votive is proud to have won best hospice. We'd love to help you when you need us. Call Krisha at 830-928-9956. Knopp Healthcare and Votive Hospice. Small town heart, generations of care. When it comes to managing your financial investments, any idea how much of your money it takes just to cover your investor's fees? My name is Eddie Kramer, Certified Financial Planner Professional from the Battle and Billy Class of 2000. At SSBNT Wealth Management, all our advisors are on salary, so we never receive commissions, loads, or kickbacks from your investments. So guess who keeps more of your money? You do. Your plan, your goals, your purpose. Give us a call today, 990-7750. Let's go. Arizona Plumbing, your full service plumbing provider for the Fredericksburg community and beyond. We have the tools and experience for comprehensive residential and commercial plumbing, including everything from water filtration to drain services for new construction or even remodeling. Have an after hours emergency? No problem. Don't settle for less than the best. We're online at arizolaplumbing.com or give us a call at 830-998-4336. Top five reasons we love Gaddy's in Fredericksburg. Number five, their student teacher lunch discount. Number four, their all you can eat buffet. Number three, they have a huge variety of fresh veggies at the salad bar. Number two, Gaddy's pasta and pizza is always hot and ready. And best of all, they even do the dishes. Gaddy's Pizza, Highway 16 South, across from the fairgrounds. Strayer and Offers has been going strong since 1928. They specialize in tires and tire repair, wheel balancing, front end alignment, brake repair, tune-ups, oil changes, belts and hoses, complete auto repair. Make sure you check out the Kawasaki Mules and custom built trailers ready to go to work for you. For quality Chevron products, Strayer and Offers, 509 South Adams Street, Fredericksburg. Call 830-997-4382. Check them out online, StrayerandOffers.com. The FISD Education Foundation strives to inspire students, drive teachers' innovation, and pilot new educational programs. The foundation donates necessary funds to move FISD toward academic excellence on all five campuses. 
To donate, volunteer, or see for yourself how our grants are creating a lasting impact in educating our community, visit us at FIS3Kids.org. Texas Hill Country Orthopedic, the official sports medicine provider of the Batland Billies. Our board certified and fellowship trained doctors provide personalized and comprehensive bone and joint care for all ages. We utilize the latest technologies like platelet rich plasma treatments and also unique to the Hill Country, we offer anterior hip replacement. Whether you've suffered a traumatic injury to your shoulder or are just tired of dealing with arthritis pain in your knees, Texas Hill Country Orthopedics and Sports Medicine is here to help. My name is Rick Barangi, and I'm the owner and founder of Long Neck Manor. I met Donnie uh, several years ago because I was building a state-of-the-art barn for my giraffe, 10,000 square foot barn, and there's nobody in uh, the area, not just Fredericksburg, but in the region that could understand the complexities of building such a structure. Donnie's team is amazing. When they come out here, they're very professional, they're quick, they're thorough. You get a product even better than you expected. Welcome to Creek Street Dental, where we strive to treat our patients with compassion, kindness, and care. We utilize the latest technologies in our commitment to your family, offering cone beam technology, cosmetic dentistry, and sedation dentistry so you can sleep through your appointment. Stop by and meet our newest addition, Dr. Monica Montgomery from the Fredericksburg High School class of 2014. Creek Street Dental on the corner of Creek Street and South Adams in Fredericksburg. Well, howdy friends, this is Paige Finley from FBG and Billy's Dot Live. I want to tell you about some new friends I met at J4 Trailer, a family-owned Texas trailer dealer out 290 just east of Fredericksburg. They carry utility trailers, livestock trailers, cargo trailers, and if you're looking for all the bells and whistles, they can custom build just about anything. Food trucks, car haulers, trash, or landscape trailers, whatever you need. Give them a call today, 830-997-9969, J4 Trailers. That's where I got mine. At the Real Estate Advisory Team, we know the Texas Hill Country, and we know Texas Hill Country Real Estate. Now we're good. We got thumbs up. All right. I'm Kerry Burgess, Fredericksburg Standard Radio Post on Billy's Live tonight, and another shutout win, 15 nothing. It's a big game again. You uh, went in what four innings, I think it is, yeah. and uh, do you get? like 15 cupcakes is that how this all works yeah, madison you kicked it off tonight with a home run uh right off the bat so uh and you you just drilled it out of here now last time you were here i was going to interview you and then the ball got held up this time it didn't yeah thankfully yeah, talk about, <laughs> thankfully. you had a mouthful of, of yeah, cupcake but that's all right that's what makes these interviews all so much right. fun that's right. talk about how, how big this was this is the last district game right it felt great to go 10 and 0 in districts like mm -hmm such a big accomplishment I'm so proud of everybody here because I could we couldn't have done it without each other so how does it feel heading into a uh, playoff mode now uh, how do you think this team is going to approach getting into the next level taking it to the next level I think we just need to keep working hard like we've been doing and like if we keep our chemistry and our bats going we're gonna be fine yeah. we're gonna go far and base running too oh yeah, yeah. I think y'all had something ridiculous. I added up the runs, and this is not scientific math, but I think I came up with 196 to 15 that you, you've outscored your opponents since February 29th, and that doesn't include district. I think it's 95 to see you have 15. What does that make it? 110 to 5. 
Wow. In district. <laughs> I did not know that. So, wow. And you moved up to number nine in the latest TGCA poll. How does that feel? That feels great. Didn't know that either. <laughs> You start, learn something new on Billy's Live every yeah, night. Educational program. There you go. So going ahead, what do you think a big theme will be this week as you prepare for the playoffs? Work hard. Like, don't give up. We have a shot, and we know it, but we got to make sure we stay humble and keep working hard like we are the underdog no matter what. All right. Well, congratulations, Madison. Good night. Eat your cupcake. It's, it's well worth it. Sydney, I haven't interviewed you before, so this will be the first time I get to interview you, but you had an inside-the-park home run tonight. That was worthy. And uh, the fact that you ran the bases and you and you didn't hit it over the wall, but you get a home run for that. Yep. <laughs> Talk about that. Um, honestly, I just went up there and I was thinking base hit, and I, I just kept running and, yep. <laughs> that's it. Well, I mean, that's how it happened, right? Uh, it, what, what did you see when you hit the ball? What did you think, hey, this is going to be a good hit for me? Um, well, right off the bat, I felt it was good, and then I saw it hit a gap, and I was like, I'm, I'm going to go, like, all the way. So, yeah. yep. So you come in, and you're playing first base tonight, first base very effectively. Let's talk now about the defensive effort that this team puts out. Um, well, I think that definitely with our amazing pitchers and just the chemistry that we have, um, I think we just need to constantly like uplift each other. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> um, oh, um, but we just need to stay together and keep doing what we're doing. <laughs> I think Ava may be lost here, uh, and she, she's afraid. Of, I don't. This may or may not happen. We'll see. Uh, but sit. <laughs> Somebody better take the camera. I'll tell you that. Don't get the camera. But anyway, uh, Sydney, uh, you have some putouts at first base too. How does it feel for you just coming back out and hitting the field again? Um, it feels great just being out here, being able to play, um, just playing softball. And with district championship now under your belt, uh, what do you feel heading into the playoffs? Um, I think we just need to stay with our level and stay the team we are and just play how we are. All right, well, congratulations, Sydney, for the Inside the Park home run. You end up with, uh, and I've, I've interviewed you many times, Ava, and I'm watching out. <laughs> I better hide this camera. That would be a, anybody want to take the camera here? Uh, yeah, tell them no. Tell them no, wait to the camera. All right, so anyway, oh, it's coming. <laughs> It's a dangerous job, folks. <laughs> you're back. They get you there? They did no, a little nut. Yeah, you're fast. You're too fast for them. Okay, so you have 200 strikeouts. Mm -hmm. Career? Uh, no, just this season. So only this season, yes. That's incredible. And you had 12 the other night. I don't know how many you had tonight. Um, just five because we wanted to hit the 200 mark, so just five. Was that the plan, just having you come out? Mm-hmm. Reach 200? Yes, sir. Yeah. All right. Now, this has been a special team. Now, how do you prepare for district? Uh, not district, but the next level, playoffs. Um, I think just continuing to do what we do, and we know that playing in playoffs is another step up, so we know that we have to step up our game, too, to play at those levels, and I think just, like, working hard and continuing to grow as a team, that's probably the most important thing we need to do. You have a unique combination of not only being able to strike out batters in the circle, but also being able to knock out home runs and have an excellent hitting potential for you. So you can do offense and defense. That's a unique trait. Uh, so how do you feel that is helping you in, in getting the team here to the next level of the playoffs? I see another bucket coming. <laughs> this is one interview that's never going to finish. <laughs> Maybe you better wrap this up or we're going to get smothered here in Gatorade. All right. But heading to the next level, uh, this is exciting for you. What do you. I think this team could go pretty deep. How about you? Oh, I agree. I think just trusting in each other and just the team chemistry that we have, and I think that's the biggest thing. So I'm really excited to see what we can do as a team. I don't even know what to ask anymore because <laughs> we've been distracted yes. by the Gatorade bucket. <laughs> And uh, so far, I've survived. I'm not sure how you're going to do. Yeah. <laughs> so um, anything else you'd like to add other than go, Billy? Um, I would say all glory to God, and let's go. Awesome. Yeah. Well, you do a great job, and we'll see you in the playoffs. Yeah. All right, it's going to wrap it up for me, Billy Slive, tonight. About, what, four or five? Uh, you want to, Sherwin, Coach Sherwin, you want to come over real quick? 
Let's get Coach Sherman. Got to have some final words with you. Uh, somehow we amazingly did not. That camera over there. Um, the camera didn't get the Gatorade. I was shocked. Talk about your game tonight, though. You, you for, for, First of all, I put it in the paper. You mentioned to me Brenda Wolf was going to have a big night. She hit two home runs the other night, and she sure did. Uh, so she's coming along. Talk a little bit about that, and then going forward from tonight's win, what do you expect in the playoffs? Um, you know, we expect to be consistent. Um, Brindle, you know, Brindle's been really coming along, um, but we're not we're not just about one player, um, and that's that's what makes us a team, and I think that's what makes us a threat. Um, you know, you saw tonight. You know, Ava gets her 200th. McKenna comes in. McKenna, you know, has a shutout. Um, top top to bottom, we continue to hit. Defensively, we did what we did, um, and so that's that's the biggest thing you know these kids continue to show up they continue to play um, it really doesn't matter if it's home away what dugout we're in um, they just want to play the game together um, and that's that's really kind of the focus as we move forward you know at this point we're district champions tonight um, our JV our JV went through district undefeated our varsity went through district undefeated um, and you know we'll go home we'll enjoy it um, and tomorrow, everybody's zero and zero. And, and at that point, you know, we're playing to have a couple more weeks together. And hopefully this kind of carries us into um, a long, deep run. Which we all are hoping for, and this is a team definitely capable of that. You pulled off 18th win in a row, I think, is what I've uh, figured out. That's just rough math in my head. But 18 wins in a row tonight, including the 10 and 0 district run. Yeah. Um, you know, I, th I think that's, that's really kind of been the focus all along. You know, it's not it's not about how many we're having in a row. We're trying to pass the bat. We're trying to get hits in a row. And you know, if we get one, if we can go one and zero each night, that's how you end up in a position that we're in right now. Um, and that's that's really kind of been what's led to these results. Anything else you'd like to add? One game at a time. I know that's your motto. Yeah, uh, one game at a time. And so um, we live to play one more. And that's a great thing. I appreciate you. You bet. And congratulations on the district championship being undefeated. All right, that's going to wrap it up for me. I'm Kerry Burgess with uh, the Fredericksburg Standard Radio Post. We went to print today, so this game will not be in this week's paper, but we'll be in next week's paper. And uh, I'm not sure when playoffs will start. When does that? Do you have any rough estimate? Playoffs will be the week of the 25th through the 27th. We will probably play Lavernia, uh -huh. um, and the details will be coming. We hope to see you out there. All right, thank you, Coach. Thank you. That's Tim Sherwin, head coach of the Fredericksburg Batlin Billies softball team. Uh, so next week, playoffs already. Congratulations for winning the district championship, Fredericksburg. And uh, we'll throw it back to you. I'll have all full story coming up at the Fredericksburg Standard Radio Post next week. Have a great night.